Welcome to podcast on IELTS speaking. You are to describe an occasion when you spent time with a young child. You have one minute time to prepare. Start preparing. After one minute. Kids can make our mood jovial and everyone wants to spend time with them because of their innocent, cute, selfless acts which can fascinate everyone. I also got chance to meet such a cute little chatterbox who is nephew of my best friend. Actually, his sister had come to attend relative's wedding and while doing preparations, she handed over her three-year prankster son to us. Initially, it was hard to do babysitting of an agile chap, but then we used trick of showing YouTube videos of cartoons. On this, his mother disallowed as it could make their child addicted and could affect his eyesight. Then we tried to keep child engaged while playing hide and seek. Soon this idea too failed because not only kid disliked, worst part was he called us boring. This act of him made us to burst into laughter at the same time. I was also stunned how come three year old toddler can think like that. Then child suggested us to take him for a bike ride. Initially we denied going out in hot sun. Later we had no other way else this for keeping him occupied. He wholeheartedly relished the ride and also stood on tank of bike with both his hands in air. During this ride, child did so much mimicry of his mother and father which tickled our ribs and made us to please him by giving him ice cream treat. Back home, when I told this naughtiness of him to my family, all were amazed and stunned to know how sharp kids these days are. Okay, that is the end of section 2 of speaking interview. In section 3, I would like to ask you some follow-up questions about children. Do you think there are too many rules for young children to follow? Yes, these days, rule book has become much thicker and childhood is not as worthwhile as it used to be 20 years ago due to so many threats related to society health insecurity parents have become very cautious about their children additionally the enlargement in list is also because of parents over expectation who want their kid to be apt at so many skills whether at school or at home do you think children should follow all rules? Well, it is practically impossible for kids to abide by all regulations. It should be considered satisfactory. If youngsters are sensible and honestly following rules, there will also be things which are out of reach. If these things are neglected, parents should not bother. Hence, I would say following all rules is not must. Do you think it is necessary for parents to take decision for children? At the initial stage of life, parents can take decisions on behalf of youngsters, but for later, kids should be made independent. While this, they should be given some liberty because some decisions may be wrong. I think it is necessary for them to make mistake. Learning from it and acting accordingly can automatically happen. At this, parents only need to supervise them and later that is also not required. How do parents teach children to respect people? For mostly, it is not something which can be taught forcefully or by regularly reminding them. This is an etiquette which can be best taught by making kid understand logic that if he gives due regard, others would duly regard, like giving and taking. Else to this, teaching such moral value can be better than by telling mannerism related story. Do outdoor activities help children? Definitely, outdoor activities assist in all round development of tiny dots. They socialize and make friend circle. Then they play and prepare themselves physically for future. They develop their muscles, respiratory organs. On top of everything, game and sports are best stress buster. These utilize negative energy positively. What are the differences between outdoor activities children play now and before? Well, that is very good question. Times have seen sea changes in leisure activities broadly. 20 years back, 
there were many active and outdoor activities such as playing cricket playing hard and seek tip cat marbles skipping rope bicycling and many more now mobile games and social media have taken place what is more social insecurity and weak immunity do not allow parents to allow their kids to be more outside well that is the end of part 3 and the end of test please like share and don't forget to subscribe american institute of ielts for more such videos